everybody. Welcome back, DNA fam. Guess what today is? What's today? It's my birthday! How old are you? No, okay. you don't need it. Next question. Uh, <laughs> so today, for the very first time, because it's my birthday, we are celebrating by doing a mukbang, or a mukbang, mukbang, whatever it's called. <laughs> Skip has no idea about them. But it's basically like an eating show. So basically we're going to talk and have conversation and eat. And that's it. So you ready to dig in? Well, first tell them what you, what you um, have for your birthday. Yes, my husband, um, he made me potatoes, lobster, crab legs, corn, and then we are featuring B-Love's Smackalicious Sauce. <laughs> That's Ashley's uh, friend. She found and followed this lady online for her lobster and her sauces. Her seafood so boils and muffins. I'll just say thank you. Hey. B-Love. B-Love, thank you for the recipe. Ashley loves it. Yes, I do. Yes. It's not bad. It's not bad. Yes. Oh, I forgot. I got no fork. No, you eat it with your hands. To scoop out the potato? Yeah. No. You eat it with your hands. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right. I don't know, but it's gonna get messy then. Yeah, it's gonna be messy. All right. Um. Man. All right. So let's say grace. Okay, Lord, we just thank you for this day that we get to celebrate Ashley's life. Thank you for gracing me and all of us with her presence. Thank you for the woman she's been and the woman that you're continuing to form her into. So we just celebrate her and thank you for another year of life. Thank you that you've helped her become a mother from a single woman to a married woman to a mother and for all the other things that come along with that. We just bless you. Bless this food. Let it be tasty. It was my first time cooking lobster and crab. So let it be delicious, Lord, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let's dig in. I'll let you go first. Uh, okay. Well, you know I'm going to make a crab egg. Of course. <laughs> I think I'll take the lobster. and uh, So, why did you want this to for your birthday? Well, of course you know seafood I, is my favorite. Yeah, but why, why we had to do this mukbang or mukbang or, or why do you want to do that? Because I watch so many online, I just... Oh. Which is weird. People don't think I'm weird, okay? I I love food, so I yes, like to watch. Do. So yes, I like to do. watch eating shows. Every day. <laughs> yeah. All right. So um, tell them about the sauce. Like, tell them like what's in the sauce. Where you got the idea about the I'm sauce? I'm not gonna tell them what's in the sauce, but oh, mm, it's so good. No oh, boy, here she go. I will leak. Leak. It's like it's not out already. I will link. Um, the recipe down below if you're interested. It's so good though. She's supposed to have, um, she's supposed to be coming out with the sauce, selling it in the stores and stuff. So, oh, really? so is uh -huh. she going to take the recipe like offline when she starts selling it or is it still going to be available? Mm -hmm. Apparently, she added some secret ingredients or something to it, so she's going to leave this recipe up. Oh, okay. But. That's like two point. Ooh! Hello. Mm. What? No pick. What the sauce? <coughs> yeah. You made it like that. Woo! Ah. Oh Hello my gosh, I, I usually bite my shells, but I don't want to bite them on a camera. Well, you don't want to show them what you really do. You want to act like you all sophisticated. Oh, please. She be sitting here cracking, biting, and then be like, no tomorrow, and then be like, okay. Yay. I don't need scissors. I don't need no crab cracker. I, I don't need any of that. The meat be out in one piece. Like she's a pro. Oh yes, I am. You trying to act all new and shoot on your birthday. Well, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit younger, so. <laughs> a little bit younger than what? Yeah, I get younger on my birthday. Oh, is that true? Yeah. Oh, okay. I've never heard that. Must be. You know, friend and butter. Babe, you gotta show him, um, excuse him, he never done this before. Oh, I'm just eating. Well, I've never done it before, but I know what they supposed to look like, so. 
You have to show them like the meat and stuff. Ooh. Like you can hold up the lobster. Show all them this. all that. I'm gonna just eat a little bit of this and then I'm gonna pass it to Ashley because it's too much. Mm -mm, I like my own lobster. You know how it is when you cook? Mm. You be tired and then you don't be as hungry because you put in all the work. Well, you gotta eat all this with me. Huh. Oh, I was about to put it in my mouth. <laughs> I'm not about to eat all this. I'm going to just break with my teeth, y'all. Don't, don't judge me. I'm going to break with my teeth, but don't judge me. Judge her. Judge her. Judge her. Now. Oh, this was hard. No, let me not do it with my teeth because... If your teeth break on this video, we will stop and go to the dentist. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, dentist closed. Because you don't have to be toothless till the morning. <laughs> Don't break no teeth on this video. <laughs> Baby, you're funny. So when did you, it's your birthday, so we're going to learn a little bit about you. Oh, look at When um, did you, like, find out, like, crabs were your thing? Like, you're just so in love with crabs. Like, how old oh were you? Gosh. Or what, you know, what really turned you on to crabs? Because, um, you know, some people don't like crabs. Well, I don't know what's wrong with that. Uh, some, some people are allergic. Yeah, well, that's different. Between but then some people and just don't like seafood. So it's like, what really turned you on to all of this? Um, well, I don't know. See, I'm from Jersey. Uh, you don't know. She talks like she's from the South. Yeah, but I'm really from Jersey. Um, and we used to have this... Uh, Chinese restaurant, an all-you-can-eat restaurant. It was called Sharon Zhang's. Holla, if you remember Sharon Zhang's. The place was dirty. It was two of them. No, it was, <laughs> it was two of them. One wasn't as clean as the other. You know that place Ooh, used to be dirty. Don't talk about them. They might have another restaurant. I hope they got better, but everyone knows they got shut down because they had bugs and Ooh. all that stuff. Well, before that time, um, <laughs> I used, used to go to, to Sharon Zhang's with my family and stuff. And we used to just do all you can eat crab legs and stuff, but I've always liked crabs. We used to go to Baltimore and go to different restaurants and have all these different uh, blue craw blue claw crabs. But as I got older, it's, it's special. But as I got older, I really loved the uh, snow crabs. Snow crabs. So we started off with blue. It graduated to snow. Mm -hmm. And then you kind of stopped there. Mm, I like everything. <laughs> But, for real, for real, like with my dad and my mom and stuff, we used to always go crabbing with our crab baskets and all the time, so mm -hmm. it's always been crab. I'm not that Babe, you have to be messy. No, mm-mm-mm. No, no, no. Oh, this sauce kept kicking up in that mm mm Oh, is it too spicy for you? And you Ooh. gave me all this stuff at the bottom. Oh, I think I made it too much. I'm about to sell mine. Yeah, see, can you see? I don't know if you can see it. Because usually they know. have it in like clear, big bowls. So. Woo. Well, next question. <clears throat> Too many crushed peppers. Oh, I gotta put some lemon. We forgot the lemon. I didn't forget, lemon. but I think I put too many crushed peppers. All right, so you've had lobster. You ate around a while. You know, lived in you said Cali. You ate around. <laughs> lived in New Jersey. Uh huh. Where was your favorite time of eating lobster? Lobster. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, I know. My favorite time of eating lobster. Uh, so you look. <laughs> One whole piece. We pros over here, okay? Um, my favorite time eating lobster was in Chicago for my thirtieth mm -hmm. Oh. Uh oh. You're not in your twenties no more. That was like last week, so. We did not go to Chicago last year. <laughs> um, uh, it was for a birthday. Um, we went to Chicago, and well, I can't remember the name of the restaurant. I don't remember either. I have to look it up. Yeah, we'll look it up. 
Um, but if you go into Chicago, I'll even put a picture right here it's of the on, place. It was on the steakhouse. And that lobster was so good. So wild. Mm. That's when they came and cracked the show open and parted the Red Sea for you. Oh my God. Let the thing sit up all pretty. Yes. Oh my God. And then she it? ate it all, not a drop left. <laughs> no. Okay. You're not going to have no drop left with the lobster. Really? With the, with the lobster? So, it's your birthday. Babe, how many times you gonna say that? It's you know your that? birthday. It's your birthday. Do you feel any different? Um, well, I think with the age that I am now is when you really, or when I really am going to just feel like everything coming together, like with being a mom, because I'm like a new mom. Mm -hmm. I feel like everything will set in and just be like everyday life. What does that mean? At this what do you age? Mean everyday life? Where I'm gonna be really like in into my career, like it'll be a flow. Like I have to really get into the flow. Oh. So I feel at this age, the difference will be um, the flow of having my career and having the baby and All of how everything maneuvers. Together. Yeah. This thing is empty. Uh oh. What kind of crabs you bought? <laughs> <laughs> so just this, the alignment of the all parts of your life starting to come together mm -hmm. at one time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh no, you're supposed to be messy. You're supposed to get your hand messy. Mm -hmm. Six minutes. So. Okay. Babe, did you give me your lobster? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, why, babe? Pass it off to you, taste it. Mm -hmm. Huh? I think dripping. Mm -hmm. Just the taste skin to put it on. Mm -hmm. I don't even eat the skin. So you tell me, people make these videos and eat, and people sit at home and just watch people eat. Yeah. And, and this is a thing. This is a thing. It's called a mukbang or a mukbang. Um, but yeah. Who and started this thing? I don't know. I'm I'm just trying to understand. Rep. Come on. Hey, I was living. <laughs> you gonna give me bad? I'm just trying to wrap my head around. <laughs> Why, like, people would sit home and just kind of, like, watch us eat? Well, would they pull up some food and eat with us? Like, I, how does this work? Sometimes they do. You've done that before? No. Oh, okay. But, it's like, I heard sometimes with people feel like if they don't have families and stuff, and they don't have people to eat with, they will turn these videos on, they will pull up, to their table, watch these videos, and eat with people from the TV. Do they eat the same thing or do they eat different things? Sometimes the same, sometimes different things. So it's kind of like watching the food network. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for me, watching the judges eat. Wishing you could Tasting have the some. food, wishing I can taste the food. Yeah. The potatoes are good, you know, fry them. Did you dip it in a sauce? Mm. Don't need to. Don't need to. Mm -hmm. You left them in the pot long enough cooking and all that. Good uh, seasoning. Mm -hmm. Piece of shell. I'm going to bit my toe. Okay, That's insane. What's insane? That's too much crushed pepper on there. No. Your mouth going to burn. Your nose going to run. That's better than me. If you could have one wish on this birthday, 
what would it be and why? Oh my god, what would it be? I feel like I'm already living my life. Oh, no. Nah. I'm already living your what? I'm lying. I was going to say I feel like I already got it, but no. Nah. Oh, here we go. I wish. I wish for. Am I supposed to tell my wish? Yeah, sure, why not? I wish for world peace. No. Ooh. That's not my wish. <laughs> What are you wishing not for? Not my wish. What are you wishing for? My wish is that I will win the lottery, the Mega Million, on my birthday. <laughs> on my birthday. <laughs> is that 250 something million? Lord. That's enough for me. <laughs> she always say that. That's enough for me. That's enough for me. After they pay <coughs> taxes, it'll probably be half of that. That's enough for me. You really believe you're going to hit the lottery one day? Yeah. Why not? What Why makes not you me? different from everyone else that plays and believes this thing? I'll be circling. <laughs> <laughs> so you think you're going to hit the lottery? Yeah. I mean, if you hit it, you hit it. I mean, because we're going to be living right. But and a lot of other people are going to be living right, too, if I hit it. So y'all better wish for me to hit it. See, now everybody gonna mean something about you hit and you said yeah. you share, so pass That's on. Right. If I hit 10%, <laughs> gotta get taken out of that first. You know why? For the Lord and them. After that, some people gonna be blessed. I ain't, I ain't going crazy keeping all that money to myself. People go crazy when they got yes. too much money. <laughs> you know what, let me try. I promise I won't get crazy. Just <laughs> I'm just saying like that, especially like when things don't go right and stuff. Mm -hmm. No, I'm giving it away. I mean, I'm going to invest it, but I'm going to give it away too. Okay. So y'all better hope I hit the lottery. If y'all don't play and y'all don't hit, <laughs> go ahead and send a prayer up there for me. <laughs> yeah. God ain't answering no lottery prayers. Oh. All right, let me try a potato. I'll put two on my plate. And I'll take some without the sauce. See how you did. Should sure taste that skin. Mm. Oh yeah, I always my skin on. Mm. Yep. Yeah. My skin on. Now the dip. Butter sauce. That's what you call butter sauce. There's so much other stuff besides butter. You call it butter sauce? Yeah. I call it just concoction. Mmm. Good. Have y'all never tried this before? You gotta try it. It's good. That doesn't look like it can't be healthy. What, the cheese Mm-hmm. I don't eat it every day. This looks like it's too much. Like it is a lobster. Edit this out. I gotta clean my teeth. No, I usually don't eat like this. So, I don't want y'all to think no gluttony is happening over here. <laughs> Babe, I do not eat like this. Oh! Don't lie. Uh, the lobster, no, but these crab. When I was about to ask. Mm. Mm. There's been even a lot of crabs. Within the last month, did we not get crab one, and the next day you say go get some more because you had leftover sauce? What are you talking about? Ah, okay. Why are you talking about bacon? Mm-hmm. Just want the record to show facts, not tales. Babe. Yes. With some changes that you would like to see from me. Uh oh. Don't get all marital. Um, <laughs> you need a white, white, but like you got like a sauce line and like a little goatee. Okay. There we go. I got it. 
Thank you, baby. Yeah. <laughs> so, what would you like some things that you would like for me to change this this birthday year? What I want you to change? Mm -hmm. I would like you to be more consistent and focused on some things than follow through and do some some ends. Mention some ends? Like the ends of Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, follow it through to the end. Okay. A little bit more consistent. That's fair. Um, and yeah. Cause I think that you have some ideas and some thoughts and some some things you're kinda of in the middle of, but I think you need to get to the end of some of those things. And it takes being consistent and focused all the way through. I think you can do that this year, it, it would be a good step for you. Okay. Thank you. That was a safe answer. Mm -mm. Inbox me for the real. <laughs> Just joking, baby. Like, have a little fun. Relax. Laugh. No, but I want to see you do great this year. Okay. I want to see you do great. This is how it really gets. When she really start eating, she don't do all this talking while she eats. She just, um, 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 um. and she be singing and dancing. Oh, you trying to act new? Like that's why I said I don't dancing. understand this mukbang don't really work with you because you don't eat like, and get down like that. This is a distraction from your crown jewel of food. The crown. Babe, I do not be dancing at the dinner table. Mm -hmm. No, I don't. Really rocking. No, I don't even know how to do it. I do it weird. How about something really rocking? Um, if you could have, I'm like, the sauce is still in my nose. If you could have three foods, the rest of your life, nothing else. Let the people know what those three things are. Two of them are right here. I understand. That's what I said. Let them be. One up. of them's in my hand. Lobster. Crab. And pizza. And then a close Baby, number you four. Here. You gave me all this seasoning. What did you say? I said you gave me all this seasoning. No, because of the scooper I had, it was kind of falling through. So, mm -hmm. use some of this. There's some in there. Okay, I'll take this. And then close to number four, it would be crabs, lobster, pizza, and number four would be steak. Yeah. Correct. No vegetables. No fruits. For the rest of my life, too, huh? You would be a fat cow. Uh-uh, that's you, me. If, no, I'm saying, you if, you, off this. if you ate steak, I'm just thinking, if you kept eating steak with no veggies. No, that's not healthy. No, not at all. <laughs> you would be like... No, I would nah. That would be so bad if that's all you ate. But you know, I w that's what I want you to see for Ashley. I want you to eat more healthy this year. More more balanced of like the fruits and the veggies with the meats and starches and the greens. I know. I just said healthy or just take it to the next level. Babe. Why are you doing all the talking <laughs> and not eating? Enough eating. Someone's got to talk because when you start eating, you do no talking. And I know this video isn't just supposed to watch me eat, watch me some, eat. But let me tell you, eat. some people, they eat and then they talk. Well, we're doing both and then it's going to be over. <laughs> 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 yeah, you can talk while you why you want to do the clothes, but we're going to be done. We're going to be done. This was a iced tea, sweet tea and lemonade. On her Palmer. Palmer. She doesn't like to drink while she eats, so I think I'm going to drink her tea. Mm-mm. <laughs> mm -mm, mm -mm. 
What was that? Oh, I don't think the people at home can hear you. You're not even eating. I'm, I'm kind of full. You know, I told you when you make food, you eat, and then you kind of, you be hungry, and See, then you... This is not a good mukbang when you can count the shells you have. <laughs> but I just, I'm explaining it. It was like, you wait too long, and you're not hungry anymore. Like, we came home, I cooked. Then Peyton did, you know, she was fussy because she was trying not to go to sleep. By the time you came out to do it, like, my appetite is going to sleep. Well, no, uh we're not going to sleep. No, we I said, go sleep tonight because it's my birthday. appetite went well, to sleep. You better wake up because. Why? This food ain't going nowhere. I just <laughs> always make me want to eat more than what my stomach's saying. My stomach's trying to do me right, and you're trying to see me go wrong. My stomach is saying, Skip, that's enough, because it's late. Well, I I'll can, just snack. Well, I can eat better. I mean, I can eat more than Skip anyway. For sure. Babe. Yes. I would also like for us to, uh -oh, this, this uh, birthday year, I would also like to um, be more... You know, finishing what we started, but be more consistent um, with a sown seed in this YouTube channel. Okay. How do you feel about that? Okay. Are you in? Yeah, sure. Just don't be trying to throw stuff on me last minute and then be like, come on, let's go, we gotta do it. Like, gotta be a better planner. You don't just do stuff every time in the last minute and then be mad because I ain't on board. But no, yeah, we can do it. We can do it. I mean, we did have a baby. We took some time off. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm surprised that she's not up right now. Why? This is her bedtime. She goes to sleep. But still, she wake up and fuss. I want to get in, get in better shape this year, for sure. You going to change how you eat? I don't usually eat like this. <laughs> Just say you got to change how you eat. Part of losing weight is about lifestyle and eating habits. Not diet, hey. but eating more healthy, more rounded meals in more moderation on other things. But husband, you you just was saying how I don't even be eating. Who did I say that? I haven't been. I only eat like one meal a day. Alright, and that's not healthy. That's not healthy. And, and that can actually, that don't guarantee weight loss and better shape. That just helps you along the path to malnutrition. Okay, with new moms, <laughs> it's almost like you do so much right during the day and stuff with the baby and um don't give me that look I, i'm trying to understand because you're not a new mom i know so i'm trying to understand okay. so you do so much like with the baby and you're constantly doing for the baby and if and if your baby is anything like mine your hours she's take 15 minute naps and be up <laughs> um but you kind of like in the midst of doing everything for her or for your child, you kind of forget to do things for yourself, like forgetting to eat. Hmm. I, I, I've heard people say stuff like that before. Mm -hmm. But it's learning the balance. Learning the balance that, yeah, you have a child to take care of, but also you have to take care of you or you won't be there mm -hmm. to take care of your child. But Right? Yes, but it okay. takes some time to like adjust to all of that. For sure, for sure. What's one thing that um, is a surprise to you with parenthood, or no like some, like or maybe like something that has happened that was like caught you off guard, or nothing. Nothing. Mm. Oh, so you were just totally prepared. I ain't going to say you totally. You was a pro. We sh fresh out. <laughs> I'm not going to say totally. Out. I'm not going to say a pro, but I was prepared. 
and nothing has like caught me off guard or like out of the norm or realm of expectation that this is what kids do or this is what newborns do. So I'm good. Okay. Same question to you. Um. Well, I think like I said, maybe in another video, I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, sure. But um. But just like the things, the small things that like go wrong, or like not necessarily wrong, but like just like okay. So here's one thing. Spit it out. Apparently, Come on, just spit it out. So apparently. Apparently, like, in black and African-American babies or black babies, um, they get this thing on their lips, like the inner part of their lips, like dark marks, which are called suck blisters. And I've never seen them before. I've, I've never paid attention to them. But they're called suck blisters. And Peyton had suck blisters when she was First month. Uh, between four. You usually get them between four and six weeks. Mm -hmm. So she got them right in that time. And I was just like, oh my God, I haven't seen them before. But it's like so many things, like you kind of get worried a little bit as a new parent because you want to make sure you're doing everything right. Mm -hmm. But um, and they said African Americans are higher to get that. Either. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah, you mostly just see them in black babies. Who told you that? The internet? Internet and the lactation <laughs> specialist. Oh. Um, I'm about to say Google. And it's not really like they don't really look like blisters. They it's just like look dark like marks. dark spots or dark marks mm -hmm. on like the inner lip. But they do go away. Thank God. They do go away. Mm -hmm. But see, yeah, I mean, you were. But I, just I like. Remember that you were. Like but just like sad. different sad. little different little things like that and then with me I always feel like things are my fault when something is not right or it goes wrong. And why is that? Because it's like you just caring for this little person and they can't help themselves so you automatically feel like it's your fault. Why? See, that's where I think we differ. Because I, I, I just know that things go wrong or things happen a part of life that, you know, it's not perfect, like blisters or cuts or, you know, just different things. Not saying, you know, major things, but stuff happens. And that's just life. It doesn't mean it's your fault. I can see, like, if you dropped her on her head and, you know, her head bust open, that's your fault. You dropped your baby. But it's like certain things, it's just a part of life. And, you know, you got to just kind of go with the punches. It doesn't mean that you do something wrong. So why do you de kind of default to like, it's my fault I did something wrong? When sometimes it can just be life. Well, babe. No, I'm just asking, is there, do you ever think about that? Well, you know the first incident that happened. Yeah. Do you want to say or not? Yeah, we can say our daughter, our first week of her life, she had jaundice. And, you know, there's several reasons why. You can have jaundice, and one of them is, you know, they say what helps regulate and get it down is like, you know, going to the bathroom regularly, getting enough fluids, and so Ashley thought. Yeah, because it's like their liver. Was oh wait, because you didn't, you wasn't gonna say what it was. I mean, but their liver, jaundice, but the, the liver, liver is liver like isn't, immature. It's no, not fully developed. The liver isn't eliminating a certain level of something in the body fast enough. And it's and it's not mature enough to do it. Yeah, but every day the baby is older, it matures more. Yeah. So, but part of it is they can say, you know, if you're not getting enough fluid to the baby, the baby can't eliminate the levels fast enough, mm -hmm. and so the jaundice levels go up. So Peyton had to go back into the NICU, and Ashley thought that it was because she wasn't, I guess, feeding her enough. Well, because she was also dehydrated, dehydrated. and my milk hasn't come in yet because I breastfeed. And so it hasn't come in yet, and she was a little dehydrated, and but that's, I just felt like it was not fun. But I mean, you can't make the milk come faster. It's like you were doing all you could at the time. And, you know, Lord had us, God protected us. She got her fluids. She got the little light treatment, and she came home. Yeah. 
I mean, I had jaundice when I was born. So. Yeah, so it was your fault. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, it's like, you, you can't always feel everything's your fault in life because things will happen. Mm -hmm. And if you always think it's your fault, then you are living a defeated life. In, the, in your mind, you may live out, but it's like, that's a defeated mindset, and you don't want to live like that for the rest of your life. You want to be able to say, okay, stuff happens. How do we get around it? Plan A, plan B, plan C, how do I adapt? How do I evolve and grow through it? You don't just say, oh, it's my fault. Oh, I did something wrong. Because you can say that about every single day that something don't go according to plan. And I just feel like we don't got to live like you see the balance in you? I try. <laughs> I try. You know, because it's just, you know, you know, if you think positive, think more on the good things, you can continue living the good things. You focus on the negative and the bad, detrimental, you start to tear yourself down from the inside out, and then you don't even need anybody to come against you. You're your own worst enemy. Mm -hmm. So... Take that person out of the game. Put them on the bench. Put the winner in the game. Okay. All right. You preaching? No, just talking to you. <laughs> All this mukbang. This mukbang. Mm -hmm. That's just real talk. That's all. All right. What would you like? One thing to do new this year. Birthday. What would I like to do now? Babe, no, I'm thirsty. You drank all yours. No. <laughs> Babe, you're not supposed to do that. Why not? You don't drink while you eat. I'm thirsty now. You got some cup of air over there. No. <laughs> that's not fair. Take a big gulp of air. You'll be all right. That's not fair, me. What's uh -huh. oh. one thing you like to do new this year? So y'all, if the video cut off, we were just saying that um, traveling, travel. yeah, and to see family and st I mean, well, travel to a family group. You were talking about Monterey. Yeah, I want to go to Monterey and see my cousins, um, some that I haven't seen before. Um, I've never seen me. So that'd yeah. be new for all of us. I know. But you know what? It's enough of this. Y'all done seen enough no. of this. <laughs> wait. Y'all <laughs> seen enough eating. Wait, wait. <laughs> you heard enough talking about Babe, I'm not done. It's my birthday. You can have your birthday, but no. if you want to see y'all. <laughs> Why not? People are not sitting here watching this for hours. Like, they're like, I'm hungry. Y'all sitting there eating and I'm watching y'all eat. I'm hungry. Like, That's the whole point. It makes people hungry. And like They done know. signed off and went and got dinner. Like, <laughs> no. Nah, I'm sitting here all night. What about the people who watch us with us? They watch with us, but you know what, guys? I'm sure y'all dinner is <laughs> over already. <laughs> people don't eat that long. 20 Wait, minutes. Top. This is like sitting around the table and eating with people. Listen, it's over. The no. meal is done. Hey, where are you going? Why are you on the chair? <laughs> it's time to get up. Can I be excused from the no, table? No, this is my birthday muffin. You can continue the muffin. Yeah, I'm in, I, I hope I'm in the video. If not, <laughs> y'all can have the time of y'all life. You can have the time of y'all life. Muffin away. No. I'm going. No. I'm done. Mm -mm. Mm -mm, what? This, this, this is enough. When you finish your juice. Don't drink it up. <laughs> no. Baby, stop. I'm just playing psych. No, seriously, Ashley. You had your mukbang. You had your meal. <laughs> it's, it's time to say, cut. That's a wrap. No. Baby, stop. I'm just being honest here. We did it, okay? It's all Are you... Um... Oh, God. This... <laughs> it's like, 
Okay, y'all. Said that preacher they don't want to close his sermon. He's going to keep on going. Third closing, and we all be like, brother, you said that 30 minutes ago. Oh, you ain't right. They might have got another word. Mm -hmm. The Lord might have told them something new. And sometimes they just don't want to get off the mic. Well, I'm not going. I love them both. <laughs> it's just I've been to too many church services where I've seen both. You know what? Actually... A sown seed, um, if you go to our Instagram, a sown seed is two years old. Oh, I don't know. And their really birthday, and their birthday was just, I'm talking about their birthday. Yeah, like that ain't us. <laughs> a sown seed's birthday. Their birthday was a few was. days Who ago. That? That's, oh, that's us. <laughs> a sown seed's birthday was a few days ago. So if you want to, whatever you want to see new or whatever you want us to talk about, like, you know, y'all, give us some ideas here and let us know. And if the Lord gives us a message, then we shall talk about it. Message? Message. Mm. I'm getting tired, y'all. I'm getting late. Stop being old. I mean, I know you're older than me. Hold up. Watch your mouth. You need look. You catching up? It's you your birthday. Know. You another year older. How am I going to catch up? Cause I stop aging. No. I stop growing. Well, I age backwards, so I'm never going to catch up. Mm -hmm. I slow down. All right. When I eat this last crab, we can end it. In the I'm video, so, I'm so she's going to continue eating. <laughs> Let's just make that clear. I'm so excited to do this, though, babe. Thanks for doing, making all of this and doing it. You so are just, certainly a great doctor. I'll just be slaving it. She, she just be picking on me. Skip, this is your first time doing this. I'll be slaving in the kitchen, and she just be like... Oh, you're not supposed to tell lies. Oh, I slaved over this meal. But you don't be slaving. <laughs> you be feeling before the day. I've been cooking more this year. Everything was year. good, but then again, we've been together for how long? Five years? So you've learned a few things. That's all that is. Well, <clears throat> thank you y'all for watching. I'm so excited to do this with y'all. I hope you ate something good with us. And um, if you did it, I hope you go and get something to eat really good. And hopefully. I'm so fat. <laughs> and, and hopefully you got a word during this uh, muffin. Um, hopefully we'll do another one. Well, I don't know. Why? Okay, this is the deal. No. If we go to a new place and try new foods and all that, then how about that? I'm not doing a mukbang in public. No, if you take the food back from somewhere. Why can't I just enjoy my food without having to be on a camera? How are we going to do an eating show? Who that, says we want to do an eating show? That I could potentially... Wipe your chin, you got it. How do we do an eating show that I could potentially pitch to the Food Network if you're not willing to eat. Oh, sorry. I'm sleepy. <laughs> I'm going to get on that Food Network game. She's going to eat and get paid for it. Gluttonous. I want to try these things. Gluttonous. No. You, I, you do want to eat and get paid for it. It's on my shelves. Very good. I'm surprised I ain't finished those yet. No, did she say it yet? I'm gonna take a picture for y'all when it's all said and done. And y'all gonna be like, Ashley, you enjoyed yourself, girl. Happy birthday! Take us out there so we can say goodbye to our friends and family. Well, thank you so much for spending this time with me on my birthday. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed our talk. And me and Skip, and well, make sure you like, comment, 
subscribe to our channel because we will have some fun and good videos. So, really? That's it. You want to do a video of us doing P90X? Is that supposed to be a comedy? <laughs> <laughs> we love, all we right. Love, we love y'all. See you next time. See ya.